Okay, so now we have our four objects like this. What a, I, I guess this would work fine uh, for a portrait, but let's go ahead and get a little bit fancier. We can take this object, and let's squish it a little bit, because squishing is fun. Now, let's maybe rotate it to where it's really close to 45 degree angles. And then, let's grab our handles and control key and bring it down. Maybe a little bit smaller. There, I think that looks pretty good. So now, there's a trick to keeping the rotation angle just the same. So let's put this in the following three corners, in the additional three corners. So again, we're going to duplicate this, and we're going to do the arrow left, so we already know it's aligned. And we're going to mirror it and use the Alt and the arrow key to get it pretty close. Maybe it needs to come back just a hair. Okay, let's duplicate this one again. We're using the Shift down arrow, we're going to bring it down. And then the Alt, get close. Now to get this to rotate another 45 degrees, we can flip it and then mirror it. And mirror it. I didn't need to mirror it again. So we now have three. We're going to duplicate this. Shift right arrow. Get it pretty close. Alt left arrow. And flip. And flip. Wrong way to go. Sorry about that. We're going to take this one, we're going to duplicate it, and we're going to bring it down. There we go. So let's adjust this up just a little bit. And I think we're good to go. So now the cool thing is with this frame, each of these can be either cut out individually as an overlay or actually scrolled into it. So for your first piece of homework tonight is do something like this. Now, one thing I want to want to point out is you no longer have to keep this inner white part um, white because this is one sheet of wood and we just wanted to give it a little ornate um, items so it might look really good. So, let's ungroup this to where we only select the inner part and do it black. So there you go. Now, if this is one piece of wood, you've got these items you can overlay or scroll into it. So, I want you to take this, <clears throat> and with the fonts that we have, now again, you can choose to either overlay the fonts or scroll them into it. Uh, put something uh, catchy on here, Home Sweet Home, or Sully Sells Scroll Saw Stuff at the Craft Fair. I don't know. Whatever you would like to do, put it in here to make it like a home decor sign or a home decor pattern. So, that becomes Homework Assignment 1. And I know you're going, what do you mean Homework Assignment 1? Yes, there's two of them tonight. So I will end this session with this and we'll start.